Today's movie is about two witty salesmen joining Google. Let's go see if two salespeople can join Google. Start on Billy and Nick's story. Welcome to the Movie Go channel. Enjoy the video. Oh, guys, it, it goes so fast. Oh. Hey, clickety clack, clickety clack, she's married. Salespeople Nick and Billy are working hard to sell watches. It's Billy McMahon who's in charge of witty talk. Bob? The Chrono Shock 13. There has been some chatter. The last few years have been rough. But come on, who. And then Nick Campbell, a friend and partner of many years with Billy. Yeah, they didn't tell you, did they? One day, Billy and Nick hear from a customer that their company is down. Uh, I hate to be the one telling you that. You closed the company? So they go to the boss, but the boss heartedly gives them a watch and sends them back. I thank you for your service. Megan, listen to me, honey, let's talk about this. Is this because I'm too unselfish and bad? Billy gets fired and bad things come one after another. Easy, but I can do it. You're such a great guy, but you always figure out a way to screw things up and let people down. And Billy, I love you, but I'm really tired of being let down. While looking for a job at Google, unemployed Billy comes across a Google internship recruitment ad. way through this conundrum billy persuades nick to join him in internship even though nick has found a job i'm with a customer thank sure. you for me maybe and just maybe start off on Later, this what are you talking about google yeah i know it's a technology company a field we know jack squat about nick was obviously billy's partner and friend despite this recession nick is challenging google with billy very angry and when i hit this and the video interview that started so we can be seen in the webcam. They can see how small the webcam is? No, get you to cheat. Nick, come here. Okay, but don't crowd me. Nick, get you to cheat. Will you get your cheat? I get you. Okay, good. You got us? Hi, my name is Billy. We can hear you fine as well. They don't even get nervous and they look weird, so the interviewers are not know what to do. You're shrunken down to the size of nickels and dropped to the bottom of a blender. What do you do? If we're shrunk down to the size of a nickel and there's no liquid in the blender, we go ahead and put on our back. So you take her flat on your right, back right, like right. this. Right, right, right. You just lay back and lay enjoy that breeze. Pretend it's a fan. And let the, let the okay, back this blend up all it. around Good. you like uh, this. The strange interview is over and most interviewers want to drop the two salesmen. Eleanor? Mm, they seem like really nice guys, but I, I don't think so. Okay, moving on. Uh, can I say something? But at that time, one of the Google interviewers, Lyle takes a positive view of Billy and Nick with diversity or the out-of-the-box thinkers who turn being stuck in a blender into an advantage. Billy and Nick finally set foot on Google and feel the atmosphere of a free and unorganized company and feel awkward. Oh my God, are those your dads? Seriously, same-sex partners make excellent parents. I so wish my parents were gay. There are only young people there, and Billy and Nick seem out of place because they're old. Then Graham Hotry says hello to the old people. Billy McMahon. So thrilled to be here. Oh, me too. Your interns? Yes. Shut up. But Graham found the wrong number. Deal with it. I just, you know, um, I thought you were important. Oh, shit. You're going to find some people who actually matter, but good luck. To excel at this internship, you're going to need far more than brain power. What you're going to need is... And Google rang the bell to mark the start of the internship. Right. You have five minutes... Pick your teams. Then all the elites start making teams. Picky, okay, play hard to get. College, my address is East Coast. Um, Harvard, computer science, 2390. Fine, on me, fat face. Uh, my name's Zach. Not you. Zach. University of... No. Not my team's But Billy and Nick don't have any backgrounds, so they can't make a team, so Lyle becomes the mentor to the rest of them. A group. You'll mentor the leftovers. I'm Lyle, and it's pretty much WYSIWYG. What you see is what you get. Been here at the Goog for four years. So, five interns including Nick and Billy become a team. Nia pretends to be strong on the outside, but is actually very pure. And Stuart is silent and feisty. Yo-Yo is a very heavy mama's boy and has a habit of tearing eyebrows. Good morning, interns! They are given the first challenge. It's finding the bug of the program first. Red flags. See what exceptions were thrown. I always start by drawing up strategies to sift through the code. Code, right? Code, right? Code. Earthquakes, California. That's it, write that down. Do it, do it. Only one team with a high score will be hired through the challenge among many teams. We're working. Look, guys, I'm sorry, but you're not helping. You're saying a lot of words really fast that mean nothing. 
Billy and Nick are not helping the team at all. Irritated Yo-Yo quickly solves the situation. Yo-Yo, who's our man? His name is Charles Xavier. Uh, he's a professor at Stanford. Yeah, just a few minutes away, really. Yeah. Those who naively believe Yo-Yo's joke are unlucky to find Professor X. Charles Xavier. And that's Cyclops and Rogue. We're all here. Now, come closer. I want to share some of my telekinetic wisdom with you. Well, I want you to share with me. Eventually, thanks to Yo-Yo, they get a blow. Hey, you guys find Professor Xavier? Yeah, we found him. Yeah, thanks so much. The next day, a better team atmosphere. Nick and Billy join a man who looks very professional. We can take that as a yes. All right. Look at this. William, Nicholas, person I don't know. Figured I'd find you on the cool kids' table. It's like a confederacy of outcasts out here. After being made fun of by the Graham team, a second new challenge was given to them. It is a task to check teamwork through Quidditch games. All right, teams, welcome to the Quidditch bench. Let's have a good, clean match, Nicholas. Billy, I'm lost! Hit up! Hit up! By the way, Team Lyle shows zero teamwork and zero athletic ability. Temple, time out! Time! Now look, I know you guys aren't excited that we're on your team, but we're here. Billy and Nick show leadership for the first time to their team just before they are completely defeated. The Lyle team is back together. Right, smile. No idea who that is, but we're listening. Oh, hit me! Got it, got it, got it, got it! Got it. Yeah. <laughs> They catch up with the game little by little in their own way. Eventually, Graham's foul led the Lyle team to lose the game, but Roger, a senior Google employee, began to pay attention to Nick and Billy leading the team together. Okay, come on guys, let's brainstorm this puppy. Yeah, the third task, develop an app, was given to them. Explore what apps have been most popular. Go, in go backwards to go. Hello, fellow interns, Graham Hawtrey. At that time, the Graham team, as always, leads the game differently than the others. 130 times. Boom, yeah. Great, we're gonna lose yet another challenge, we're not gonna get these jobs, and our lives are basically ruined. But the Lyle team didn't seem to be making any progress, so Billy takes his team to the strip club to cool off. Great big world out there, my friend. Just three inches up, I beg you. Oh, I think that's our cue. Here we go. Okay. okay. Nerds who have never been to a place like this experience the thrill of adult world thanks to Billy. It happens all the time. Some would say it's the point. Lyle's team enjoys the night like a bull in a china shop, forgetting their assignments. Look at that view. Come on, you're not gonna see that in your little four-inch screen. You gotta look up. Yeah. Although the Lyle team failed to develop a great app, but they became closer to each other that night. I'm texting her that I love her and I'm sending her this picture I just took of Little Isle when he made pee in the bushes. Look, he's winking. Then Nick suddenly came up with an idea when he saw Hammered Lyle. That you're drunk off your ass. That's the app. That's the app we should do right there. What? Some quiz question you gotta answer before you can send a drunk text or a drunk email or phone call. Something to protect you from yourself. Oh, let's get back to HQ. Hey, well wait. Let's, let's stay like five minutes, you know? Just enjoy the view a little more. The next day, the Lyle team immediately created the app and got good news while suffering from a hangover. Received 10 times more downloads than any other teams. It appears that you have won your first challenge. With good news, Lyle team put the pedal to towards Google. Good morning. Welcome to the Google Helpline. The fourth task is to work for Google Helpline in action. Billy stayed up all night studying to bring his fourth assignment to victory, so he is very confident. The helpline is open now. Google Helpline, my name's Billy. How can I help Google you? Google Helpline, this is Nick. Great, How so you're saying you? that you're locked out of your Gmail. Hello? So the 
Also, it seemed easy to beat Graham because dealing with people was something that Billy and Nick had always done. But here's what I want to do. I want to help you clear that up before the wife gets home. Am I making sense? Okay, you're going to assign to Google Wallet, update your credit card. Billy and Nick approach customers very friendly, unlike the Kurt Graham. I can't control any longer. Time's up! Where's that at? Things went smoothly, but Billy has another problem. Up in the corner. It's not, I can't click it. The blue one, yep. Mine wasn't clicking. Mine's gray. Is anyone else's gray? Yeah, and my instructions were explicit. Now, if there's no recording, then it's as if you didn't even show up today. We'll unfortunately receive a score of zero. Billy's mistakes are very fatal to the team because the internship program is all about team activities, not individual activities. Just, it's my fault. And uh, he was right when he said that you guys deserve better. I'm really sorry that I cost you. And then Billy runs away from it on the pretext of being for the team with the last remaining assignment left. You're not helping anybody, you're helping those kids. What are you doing? Where are you going? Hey. Nick, I'm not taking everyone down with me. Billy, let me turn these high beams on you. Give me a chance to turn you with a sports metaphor. Damn it, Th Nick, it's the best thing for everybody. Shame on you. Put this badge back on. If you're gonna quit, quit. But don't give me this crap about it's better for the team. Come on, Billy. Today's recap is over. Will Lyle team and Billy be able to work at Google after solving their last task? Good luck to the Lyle team and Billy. And there will be a good movie next time, so please subscribe. Thank you for watching. The movie recap is from Movie Okay, calm down. Calm down.